Hello again. I want to share you my uh, lesson. Uh, let me open the page. Yes. Here we are again. Let's go on. Uh, in our third lesson, I want to uh, share you some uh, new vocabulary. Uh, one of them is same. Same means aynı. aynı. Count on. Count on means güvenmek. Count on, güvenmek. Close, yakın. Get on. Actually, this word is get on well. Get on well, iyi geçinmek. Spend, spend, harcamak. Body, body, kanka. Arkadaş, yakın, kişi, dost. Back up. Backup, destekleme. Backup, destekleme. So, uh, to study these vocabulary, there is a dialogue here. Let's uh, read the dialogue together and uh, try to fill in these words into the dialogue. Okay, mom and Jenny is speaking here and they are sharing some, uh, uh, some part of their lives and some relations with their friends. Okay, let's uh, read together. Jenny, tell me about your classmates. Well, you know my friend, Emma. She is a great buddy. Yes, she is a great buddy. So she says that your, uh, her friend is a, a very good person. Yes, so she is a great buddy. Next one, we, uh, yes, we, uh, a lot of time together, she's a really nice girl. We share, or, yes, we share a lot of time together. She's a really nice girl. Or we spend a lot of time together. She's a really nice girl. So our word here is not share, but spend. So we use spend here. We spend a lot of time together she's a really nice girl spend uh, do you have any other yes we need an adjective uh, word here so we that's close do you have any other close friends do you have any other close friends close means very good friend yes someone near you all the time do you have any other close friends Sure. Do you remember Sandra? Do you remember Sandra? We meet her at the concert last month. She is a very good friend too. I blah blah well with her most of the time. Yes, we use well with get on. So get on well with. Get on well with means we understand each very well. So I get on well with her most of the time. Okay. What about two? Oh, she's one of my best friends. When I need help, she always me up. We use up with back. So uh, she always backs me up. Backup means support. Backup, support. Yes, she supports me all the time. She backs me up all the time. We have got, yes, we have got uh, the same hobby. Yes, we have got the same hobby we both like playing tennis and going skateboarding it's great fun to spend time with her so you have lots of true mates in your class yes but i don't like to do at all i don't blah blah her because she never keeps my secret i don't yes i don't Count on her because she never keeps our, uh, keeps my secret. Count on means trust. Okay, I don't trust her because she never keeps my secrets, or I don't uh, count on her because she never keeps my secrets. So try to memorize these words again. These words are the most common uh, words that the most common words in the test. 
Uh, be careful about them and learn them very well. Let's go with some uh, other uh, words. Here, uh, there are some descriptive words. These descriptive words uh, related with the uh, characters of the people. Okay, one uh, when we when we want to describe the character uh, of a person, we use these adjectives adjective words uh, and some of these are positive words and some of them are negative words so we are ex in this activity we are expected to write the positive ones uh, under the positive title and negative ones under the negative title so uh, let's go with the words first of all generous generous means German jealous Kıskanç, jealous, kıskanç. Caring, ilgili, alakalı. Unreliable, güvenilmez. Unreliable, güvenilmez. Arrogant, kibirli. Arrogant, kibirli. Understanding, understanding, anlayışlı. Sneaky, sneaky, sinsi. Sneaky, sinsi. Self-centered, bencil. Self-centered, bencil. Tactful, nazik, kibar. Tactful, nazik, kibar. Fair, adil. Fair, adil. Loyal, sadık. Loyal, sadık. Mean, cimri. Mean, cimri. Now, when we look at uh, these words, we can uh, we can decide which ones are positive and which ones are negative. So, for example, generous, generous, uh, generous means jemez, so it's a positive word. Jealous, jealous means, remember now, jealous means kıskanç, yes, it is a negative word. Caring, caring, ilgili alakalı so it is a positive word unreliable unreliable güvenilmez so it is a negative word arrogant arrogant kibirli so it's a negative feature so it's a negative adjective negative word Understanding, anlayışlı, so it is a good thing, so it is a positive word. Sneaky, sneaky, sincere, so it's a good behavior, so it's a negative word. And self-centered, self-centered, bencil, so it is a good, it's, sorry, it's a bad behavior, so it is a negative word again tactful tactful means nazi so it is a positive word fair 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 adil it's a good behavior so it is positive word loyal loyal is a good thing a good behavior so it is a positive word. Mean, mean, jimri. So it is a, uh, it is a negative behavior. So it's a negative word. So it's they are very important to describe the character of a person. So we have to learn these words very well and. Uh, you have you you will see them in the test a lot. Okay. Uh, yes. There's one more part here uh, in our lesson uh, in this uh, in this part. Let's see. 
uh, sorry. Yes, usually uh, there are some, uh, when there are some invitations, for example, we invite people with some cards from time to time. For example, when there is a wedding ceremony or when there is a school activity, there, there are some cards that we uh, invite people to, this, to these activities. And uh, when we look at these uh, invitation cards, uh, some uh, words are very important to understand uh, what happened, where happened, uh, and what is the time, etc. So, uh, in an invitation like this, uh, we have to know, and we have to, uh, we have to know so, uh, some words to understand the content of the invitation. For example, the first one is event. What event means? The activity. Okay, event means. The activity, event, or life. In other words, activity, activity. Yes. The other one is day. Day, you know, gün, time, zaman, and place. Yeah. So when we sometimes we are asked in the test, uh, the we are asked some questions uh, about uh, the details of a, uh, details of an invitation card. So they ask, for example. Uh, what is missing? Which information is missing in the invitation? Uh, for example, they ask you the time, date, location, or event. For example, if, we, if they say location, location is another synonym word for place. Okay, they say location. Location means year and place means year again. Okay, uh, instead of time, for example, they can tell you uh, when the when the activity is, for example, or when is the activity, or what time is the activity. What they can ask you the date, for example, date is not included here, but there is date as well. Okay, date. Date. Date is also important. Date is also very important. Uh, we have to know date and, as I told you, place or, in other words, location. We have to know these words. If they tell you the location, this means that it is place. Yes. When we talk about time, again, we can talk about the date as well. Or we can talk about the day or we can talk about the year as well. Year as well. We, can, we talk about year, date, location, time, day, place, or the event. In other words, activity. Yes, thank you for listening. Uh, the important uh, topics and important parts uh, are like this uh, in unit one. Uh, I want you to study uh, three lessons, uh, three lessons related to the first unit and uh, try to memorize the vocabulary 
uh, and the expression, some uh, offers, uh, offer sentences, uh, making suggestion sentences, uh, giving advice sentences, and uh, similar sentences. These sentences, we have learned these sentences. So try to learn uh, the sentences we have already stressed and uh, we are going to uh, we are going to check your knowledge with a test uh, during the week. Thank you for listening uh, and for your patience. I hope to see you again. Bye.